Good evening, guys and girls. How we are doing? How are we doing? How are we all doing? How he's doing? <laughs> oh my lord! Off to a good start. How you guys doing? Welcome on in. It's Friday, although I'm working tomorrow. Yeah. So not all happy, but it's Friday. It is Friday. Just uh, shifting some people around here. I was noticing my. Nova squad were uh, low level, and in fact, I'm probably going to have to do this. I'm going to have to do the same with the other squad. No, they're fine. They're all right. Good evening. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Easy for me to say. Uh, right. So what we were we just come back to the the base. So we've got that to deal with. Got two people to, uh, two squads to fill out. So we've got plenty of members. So let's uh, add some in. Now these are pilots, so well, there's these will rank up pretty quick. To be fair, uh, especially when we set them up for doing uh, hujima flips, freelance work. So that should be fine. Let's get them sorted. Got coffee and caramel creams. Oh, that sounds nice. Is that like um uh, caramel creams? I'm trying to think. Um, is it like a suki sweet? <laughs> a suki sweet. <laughs> oh my word. Candy. Oh no, right, level 22, that should be fine. 21, let's pop in, in there. So 21, let's pop him in there. There's a 20, pop them in there. Caramel with a semi gel powder. Should I? Oh, mmm. Seems fancy. Oh my word, I've still got another two. There's a level 21. There's another level 21. It looks like we have. I think we need to... We'll just go and have a look, see what the next bit of story is. Because we've got to do another... Uh, yeah, we've got to do another briefing. So we'll have to have a look at that and see what the sketch is. Uh, hopefully, I can't remember, I think I've got it written down somewhere. We might have enough money still. We'll have to have a look. Um, what am I doing here? Let's go and give order freelance. Right, let's just go through them all, make sure they're all on freelance. So they do make a little bit of pennies as well as level up as well. Oh, was it? Oh, right. Okay. Yeah. So we've got enough. We should have enough pennies in. Should have. And that's all saying freelance, but I don't. I don't believe it. All right, okay. I beg its forgiveness. They are all in freelance. Okay. Just make sure. Yep, they're on freelance as well. All right, okay. Right, so we're golden. Uh, 
<clears throat> yeah, yeah, I think we will, Steve. Yeah, yeah, we've never, never had it. I think it came out a little while after I stopped playing, I think. In fact, is that no right, right new? I think trading had not long come out when I stopped playing last. And I think there's maybe talk of a big, big, big ship, so... Yeah, well, we'll go have a bash at that. See how that goes. Okay, well, let's do the aim research. Let's do aim soldier. They're done. They can come out. They can come out. Yeah, I like I like big ships, yeah. I do like big ships. Feel superior to the puny ships. And then cry when you get swarmed by tiny ships getting destroyed. <laughs> Say stop shooting me. Uh, right, so let's see. So we are in the Annihilator still. Well that's it, that's what I've been led to believe, size matters. That's what I believe. Let's go start this meeting, see what the sketch is. Landing gear deployed. I think I did write down a couple of locations where to buy this ship. I I think we did, yes, uh, there's two. Oh, that's right, yeah. One of them was about 70 mil. The other one, yeah, could be like 60 odd that you're on about, Shadow. So we'll check out the two stations and we'll have a look, see what one's got the better numbers. Because I think we might as well, eh? Uh, especially likes the shields and armor more than anything else, I think. Well, now I don't know if you guys have seen the it's like been an uh, announcement video uh, from the folks that done Kingdom Come they, they're doing another Kingdom Come Deliverance 2 uh, and I watched the, the video earlier and it was awesome it, I didn't realise that the, the character Henry was actually a real person uh, I thought it was just a, a computer generated person but it's actually a real person that is cool as hell seeing seeing them in real life and just hearing them and all the rest it was awesome we'll have to play uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance again try and get that finished before I think they're reckoning possibly the end of the year for the second one welcome Athena we've heard a lot about you welcome aboard we're glad to have you on our faction thank you all for the welcome I'm eager to contribute to the WRA. All right, let's get this meeting started. Excuse me, but why are you starting the meeting? Shouldn't it be initiated by the leader of the WRA? Just curious oh. about understanding the order, you know? Oh, yeah. I've been designated as the facilitator for this particular meeting. Our faction leader has entrusted me with this responsibility to injure a smooth flow of discussions. Oh, she's got the big wooden spoon out already. Hey, let's see. You're right, Athena Drain does, does this all the time. <laughs> let's focus. Uh, Drain can do whatever she wants at this table. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. You're right, Athena Drain does this all the time. No, let's say she can do whatever she wants. I apologize wants. if I overstepped my boundaries. I didn't mean to undermine anyone's role or authority. When I'm wondering I if that's a real voice. I mean it in that sense. I'm sorry. I was just trying to understand the authority within the WRA. I wanted to clarify what to do if conflicting orders were to come from different individuals in the future. Of course. You will follow the orders of our leader. There won't be anyone else giving you orders in WRA. 
Anyway, Drain has prepared some <laughs> Anywho. Let's listen to her, if you please. I believe we should start taking steps towards joining the Galaxy Council. It's crucial for our faction's growth and recognition in the Galaxy. Additionally, not being part of the Galaxy Council could result in us being treated as a terrorist organization or an outcast in the Galaxy. It's crucial for our faction's reputation and future prospects that we establish ourselves within the Council's framework. I apologize. It seems like I'm getting too involved. However, I'm trying to understand why it is necessary for us to deal with the Galaxy Council. But I still believe we should focus on the growth of our own faction and leave the Council out of it. You were right. You were getting too involved. I think she's... That Athena's got a real person's voice because you can hear breathing in between her words and stuff. That must be the first first of the characters to actually get a proper voice by the sounds of it. Don't you see what she is trying to do? Look, I've worked with the Falrens for years. I have extensive experience in both warfare and diplomacy. I'm simply trying to leverage that experience to assist the double But it seems that a girl playing requested songs on the radio has more say here than I do. You haven't understood my role. I'm responsible for enabling the double you were AE to reach the entire galaxy. Well, let's say I killed you here and replaced you with another radio host. Wouldn't they be able to do the same job? If you use the verb kill in the same sentence with one of us again, it will be you who meets that fate. I apologize, Anka. I have immense respect for you, and I didn't have any ill intentions. I was merely trying to provide an example. He's a bit of a shit stutter, is she, no? All right, let's please move on with the meeting. This cannot continue like this. Let's get back to our main topic. What can we do to pursue entry into the Galaxy Council? Actually, I was really excited to share some positive news on this matter. I've been working on arranging a meeting with one of the Council members. Who? Zema Shun. Sima Suren? Well... Wait, I uh, never mind. Go on. He will invite us to his mothership at an appropriate time. I'm waiting for updates from him. I don't want to interrupt constantly, but I can't resist adding something else. Why do you think he's inviting us to his mothership? It's for a show of power. We need to attend this meeting with our own mothership or else we'll be at a disadvantage compared to those who have stronger leverage from the start. I agree. Having a mothership is crucial for our faction's presence and influence. It will enhance our capabilities and make a significant statement in the meeting. A mothership is a symbol of power and authority. We should definitely prioritize acquiring one to strengthen our position and command respect in the upcoming meeting. Agreed. This isn't enough. I want to address an idea that could redefine our faction in the galactic landscape. The independent factions have set themselves apart by having their own dedicated houses. Now, consider this. If we also have sub-houses within our organization, we could transcend from being merely an organization to being treated as a true faction. This could indeed give us the leverage and distinction we need in the galaxy. Can you tell us more about how this would work? Certainly. By creating sub-houses, we could establish unique identities, cultures, and objectives for each division. This could foster a deeper sense of belonging among our members and allow us to operate more strategically in various regions of the galaxy. I agree as well. Having sub-houses under our faction could lead to a more complex and nuanced approach to governance and cooperation. We could stand as a united faction with diverse perspectives. I'm pleased to see your support, Anka. To make this a reality, I have already added a section to our faction interface that will allow us to create 
manage, and oversee these sub-houses. It's time we take this step to truly become a galactic force to be reckoned with. All right, okay. <laughs> There's one more thing I'd like to add. I have some information regarding Cold's death. Oh, please. Cool. Let's talk privately when you have time after the meeting. Understood. I will inform you as soon as I receive any updates from Zemashun. Meeting adjourned. Right, so it looks like for part of the story we need the mothership anyway. That's not too bad. Possibly got the funds to get that. Uh, so let's see the big meeting. Buy a mothership, create at least three sub houses. Three sub houses. Uh, obviously, retribution is possibly on the go as well. I did. Oh no, wait for Athena to detect the locations you're missing objects. Uh, talk to Alicia in the command center of the capital station. It's a whip. Where is she? Oh, she's a. Oh no, that's a. Uh... Oh no, it's Alicia. I thought that was a shit stirrer. Uh, I'll tell you what, let's select that mission just so we know what's going on. I've been investigating the death of Cold, and I have a clue that might shed some light on the situation. Well, according to my sources, Cold visited an asteroid station on the outskirts of the system a few days before his death. He met someone there, a figure shrouded in shadows, and they seemed to be engaged in a hushed conversation. It's unclear what their discussion was about, but they looked quite tense. They left the station together, boarding a sleek, Unmarked ship. There's no record of their destination or any further interactions. It's like they vanished into thin air. All right, that's great. I'm adding the station's location to your scanner. Also, I want to say something despite my lack of authority. I'm listening. I wanted to talk to you about Athena. While I appreciate her expertise. I can't help but feel we should be cautious in trusting her too much. Perhaps it's better to give her specific tasks and orders, and limit her involvement in important decisions, even skipping some meetings. Oh. We'll go, uh, I'll take your words into consideration. Let's go with that. Thank you. Right, so we've got that mission to go on with. Uh, what else have we got? Wrong one. Uh, the big meeting officer needs to buy the ship. Need to wait for that. Still need to wait on information on that as well. So, right, so let us go searching for this uh, the ship, I think. What I'll do is I'll select that one because we'll probably get a, an update on that as we're faffing about with this big ship. Right, so we want to go to, I think there's two different set, uh, systems that had the ship, so we'll go to there first. I think that was the first one. Completed. Waiting for the thruster input.
Please approach to the jump point to start jump process. Please proceed through the gate in the path reserved for you. And Rodowski. You reach the waypoint. Might you capture route. another system as well, maybe. Although we don't really need to at the minute, I think we're making more than enough cash. From the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N three, two, one. Destination reached. Right now, I think it was well in station anyway. So let's go there. Oh, it's one of our stations. Mm. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster input. It'd be good if you got a discount in your own stations. I don't know if you do it actually. I don't know if that's a thing. Landing gear deployed. Right, okay, so here's Mother Earth. Oh, balls, I just dropped my pen. Did the camera try and follow me there? <laughs> <laughs> right, let's see. Um, oh, was it? Well, we're, well, there's two different stations, so we're going to have a look at the other station. Because usually what you find is the ships will have different, something slightly different. Now, whether it's to do with the, the shields and armor, stuff like that, or maybe even uh, perks. And like I said, this has got combat drones, it's got cluster barrage and repair drones. Oh, is it? Ah, right, okay. So, um, yeah, well, that, well, that's good then. I'm not going to complain. I wonder if the prices are like a, a sort of RNG sort of thing where you get a, a ballpark figure and it could chop and change depending on the day. Okay, so let's see. So the shields are, what, 97, 314. Armor's 94, let's see. At shields, armor. And this one's sixty-one mil, and it has uh, drones, barrage, and repair drones. Is there anything else that we really need? Nothing else really that interesting, really, is there? Um, I don't think it really matters about anything else. Right. So let us go and get the other one. But before, since we've got enough money, let's check here. Okay, I think I do need some more of these for my ship. Let's see such shields. Hey, what's I'll buy that? Okay, I'll buy that as well. Mm -hmm. 
and get the drone component as well. Just in case. About weapons. Yeah, the rail's rubbish. Even these are a little bit more rubbish than the other ones because the other ones are green that we've got in the thing we ship. Right. Oh. Actually. Uh, let's see, ship. That scanner boss, that can get sold. So let's go into here. Oh god, the suit stuff. Oh, this all oh, right. Okay, we'll have to uh, sort all that out. Oh, I'll tell you what, let's put... Can we shift stuff into here? I think we can in the services, can't we? character. I think we've got... the good stuff for that. That's something we need to look at as well as better equipment for the character, I suppose. Eh, right. Oh, we can get guns and stuff over here, can't we? So go to sell all. Armor, let's have a look. Not anywhere close. Same with that. I've got green. Again. Although that's slightly, slightly better, but only slight. A uh, decent amount actually, let's go with that. Now, do we have any bounties to hand in? What if we do? Holy moly! 404,000? 343,000 for her? Wow. Okay. Right, let's go to this other system. Go to what is it? Oh, Eleven fifty-three, wasn't it? I wish it would uh, automatically plot the route for the Stargate. Can we never you pick a, a destination out of the system that you're in? So it's kind of obvious that that's what you're wanting, isn't it? Calibration module activated. Instead of having to go into two Calibration different menus. Completed. Waiting for the thruster input. Please approach to the jump point to start jump process. Please proceed through the gate in the path reserved for you. 
You reached the waypoint of your route. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N3, 2, 1. You reached the waypoint of your route. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N3, 2, 1. Destination reached. Right. We want to go to that one, I think. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thrust airport. Where'd the door go? Oh, I forgot that ship's bugged, doesn't it? It goes at a funny angle. Or did we just park that close? <laughs> I might have just parked that close. Right, let's see what the difference is. Right, so, yeah, so the shields and armor are slightly worse than this. Oh, and this is cheaper. What the hell's going on? How, yeah, that's, that's weird. <laughs> that's, that's, uh, that's weird, but the shields and armor are worse. Yeah. Yeah. The the shields are what three million three uh, three million three uh, thousand less than the other one. Might as well just going back and getting it on that other system, I think, back in Torah. As daft as it sounds, and then at least we've got the the best one we've found. So, a little bit. Uh, oh, now let's check the rest of the the stuff while we're here, though. Hull and drone. Yeah. I'll buy these. Well, maybe the offensive, since it's blue. Oh, and maybe that one, since it's blue. Got a funny feeling they might be handy for the new ship. Hey, let's see. Oh, now they've got blue. Blue of oh, Jesus, seven million. We'll have to remember this. So what's that? One one five three. Blue weapons. Decker, how you doing? Yeah, because it's got blue stuff. That'll be. I don't know if this other ship. I presume the mother ship will have weapons. I presume. I don't know. Doing good. Glad to hear it. Not bad, Decker. Not bad at all. It's Friday, but unfortunately, I'm working tomorrow, so not be doing a two. We'll not be doing a late stream or anything. Hey, yeah, let's go back to the landing pad. Right. Let's. 
see. <laughs> to me, didn't do anything like that. I tell you what, I'm actually surprised. There's no been any issues with batteries on Ford and I. They've been uh, behaving. Maybe what I want that button. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster input. Hey, you can replace a battery, but it's bloody expensive. Um, now, I'm trying to think. I'm pretty sure likes of the, the Cougar the P have. Start, jump process. I'd like to say the battery was round about the ten grand mark. The my key could be eighteen upwards. I'm not too sure. I've never had to price them properly. We've looked out of curiosity, but uh, never actually priced them properly. Please proceed but through the gate in the path reserve. You can replace kind of it's got like dead cells. Because obviously it's all a bunch of packs inside, so you can replace like the, the array or whatever route. you want to call it. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. Although we don't have anyone trained for doing Exit that. Permission from the system has been obtained. We can work in the them. Next waypoint is being replace passed. them. And three, two, one. Um, make the system safe, diagnose them, all the rest of it, we can't open them. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. Not with the training for it. Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N3, 2, 1. Destination reached. Not that I'm aware of. Now, that could change, because obviously, uh, the more that are out there, There'll no doubt be like companies that will like refurbish and all the rest of it, but because obviously it's not like the sort of thing you can even just throw in the bin, really. Eh? Uh, it's all got to go through specialist uh, companies and stuff for even picking them up and stuff. Can to store them? The oh, you can't just have them stored normally. And they've got to be out, out of the building in a container with completed. sprinkler Waiting systems and all that sort of stuff. So it's gonna be interesting when they start getting loads of batteries kicking around. What they've got to do with them. But there'll be companies that'll set up. I think there's a company in America that have started recycling the batteries. Okay, it's like essentially it's a giant shredder. So they're like putting the batteries through the shredder. Landing gear deployed. Beat them. <laughs> <laughs> Spaceship's no slow. That's right, yeah, I watched a, a video on it. Now was it I kinda mind what the what the video was. I can't remember if it's like a program or a documentary or something, but it was pretty cool to see. Right, okay, so here's the mother airship. So this one was marginally better than the, the other one, so we'll go with that. Two million dira, but that's fine, we've got the money. It's ours. Hey, well. Right, let's have a look at components again.
Have you, <laughs> have you got me on uh, on Twitch and YouTube, Shadow? <laughs> oh my word! She'd pop out the chat, pop out the chat from one of them, put it on another one. So you don't <laughs> don't have to have me on twice. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Oh, my. What? <laughs> hey, right, okay, right. Let's uh, let's call the mothership. I don't know how this is going to work. Uh, Mother Earth. So it is here. So let's call it. Yeah, 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 the picture is better on YouTube, isn't it? Yeah, because it should be, what, 1440p on YouTube. And it's only 1080 on uh, Twitch. Holy moly. Yeah, 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 that, that's, that's a weird thing. <laughs> All right, okay. <laughs> I'm an albino. <laughs> Holy moly, this thing, this ship's huge. It's my hoosive. Wow. The big ass engines. Yeah, I was having a look at the. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. I did see a a ladder. I did see a ladder for going in. It's like a ship on a ship. Hey, oh, what was I going to say? I was going to say something. Damn. It's just popped out of my head. What are we on about? Hey, da, 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 da. Oh, yes. Yes. Uh, to do with the delay. The delay. The delay difference on YouTube and Twitch. Now, on Twitch, it's like ultra, ultra low. Oh Christ! Ultra low delay is essentially. On YouTube, because I'm doing it on 1440p, I can't do the ultra low. It's just on low, so there there will be a little bit of a difference. Yeah, it wouldn't let me do it like ultra low because of how much information is having to get sent. Which kind of makes sense. Because obviously on Twitch the maximum bitrate you can stream at is what, 6? Is it like 6 or 6.5? Six something like that. Yeah. Yeah, and that'll be to do with the bitrate as well because the bit rate's lower on Twitch than it is on YouTube. YouTube, I've got my bit rate at 30,000 uh, because of the higher quality and stuff like that. Whereas Twitch rate only being 1080, you only need six. I think it's like six and a half something. Oh, wrong buttons. Right, so we're on the ship. Two guards there. Let's have a Daisy Duke round about here.
Oh, oh yes, save, yes. Good idea. Let's do that now. Yeah, because we've not had a crash yet. But they thought there'd been a terminal for calling ships here, because obviously we've got a, a flight deck. Uh, well, I tell you what, we're going to need that. Might as well. Oh, oh now, yeah, we can have drones, can we? Um, wow, that's a lot of drones. Yes, yeah, maybe something uh, once we get in, yeah. Replacing hubs. Oh, yeah. <coughs> uh, this is the mothership, uh, Jean. Uh, the mothership, which we've not uh, not had any experience with yet, we just bought it. We're just uh, having a little wander about and stuff. Uh, replacing hubs, David. Is it a front or a rear hub? Yeah, no problem. Oh, rear hub. Uh, ah, yes. As long as you've got the tools, you can. I mean, it shouldn't be bad, but it could turn bad. Kind of if the bearings are stuck in the stub or whatever, then yeah, you need to, uh, you might need presses and stuff. So I don't know if you'd want to try and tackle that yourself. Oh, so that's like a teleport thing. Oh my word. Don't like how they've done the glass. Yeah. Yeah. Well, some bearings, that's that's how you go about it anyway. You replace the hub uh, on some cars. Um, the thing is, you'd soon know, can if you take the, the center nut off uh, and if it slides off then that's it you're fine if it doesn't slide off then you might be in, in for some trouble right what's down here so we've got a hangar RS-108 yes I suppose yeah if, if it doesn't slide off then yeah yeah then you might need to do further things you can like take the stub off the the axle and stuff like that, and it can turn messy fast. Oh, Jesus, this thing's it's just a maze. Alright, hold on. Mechanics. Oh, 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 ship upgrade console. I know, yeah, yeah. It would be quite cool if this had a multiplayer component, definitely. I think we can't fly that. Didn't think so. It looks uh, a bit janky anyway. That's what it looks like, eh? <laughs> I 
Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the people that park with the wheels turned, yeah. They're just as bad. Uh, oh my word. And that looks rough. Right, so we've got an upgrade station here, so that kind of makes sense because there's no way we'll be parking this inside one of the the faction hubs, eh? See, it's funny that can shows our rain cockpit that way, but doesn't he mention the fact that the the hangars there? The, Jesus. Right, okay, let's have a look here. Zone 9. F to enter, interact ship. Oh, all right, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Wonder what the hell it was on about. Right, okay, so we've got storage. Let's go down to storage. Storage. All right, okay, so you've got a, a cell or a cell all. Oh, so that could be quite handy. We've got mechanics there, hangers down there. Cockpit this way. Got another storage. Not a very big storage. Okay. And what was this? Cockpit armory. Nothing that way, no. Cockpit that way, armory this way. All right, okay, so we can fill ammo and stuff. I think that's all we can do is fill ammo. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Now we've got two ways to the cockpit, I suppose. Right, so what's the RS-108? Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, that was the same with the, the other command ship, remember? Uh, I remember that. It was, ah, yeah, it was pretty, pretty god awful until you sort of set it up. Right, so we have got the, the fast travel. So, how the hell do you get your other ships here? Tell you what, let's, uh, let's fly it. So, I wonder if we just fly away from the station. 
because I'm sure you can land your other ships on here. Oh wow, okay. There's services. So let's have a look. So we've got we've got the drones, we've put drones in it, we don't have rockets or torpedoes. Weapons we've not got any. Um components, obviously we've got them to deal with. In fact we should have a whole load of stuff in the bank. Uh, so let's see, so we've got God. I think we've just got to put it all across. Don't know why I put the the lasers there because it can't have the ones. Don't know if it needs cargo. Right, let's have a look components. Uh, let's see shields. Right, okay, so that's a good one. Twenty two. Of course. Why why can't it just do that? You do it ah yeah, loading them, yes. Uh, but swapping the, the swapping the stuff out, I don't think you can do that through the call ship interface, can you, Grams? Uh, right, weapons. So it's that one. That's twenty four point two. Right, let's see. Twenty four point two. Twenty four point two. Let's put that in there now. Uh, all series. I've done the weapons. Yes, we have. Okay, so the, the weapons is fine. I tell you what. Ooh, ah, no. <laughs> I'm trying to work out what I'm doing here. It was not implemented. I thought that was a whole idea of it, having the hangers and stuff like that. Was that not implemented? Oh really? All right, okay. We'll have to uh, we'll have to test it out because I'm wondering if we fly off the the station and then jump out and then head to the station. I wonder if we can haul our ships. He'd have thought it would have that function here, eh? Well, exactly, yeah, exactly, yeah. If it was a year ago, Steve, then yeah, yeah, it might have changed. Right, okay, so the hull series on the other ship, on this ship, is actually better than that, so that can get to. Scanner, it's not got a scanner. Engine burner. Yep, we can do that, right? So let's see, where's the engine burner? Put that in. There's drone component, but it's not got a thing to compare it to. Uh, let's see, defensive, yeah, we can put that in, so defensive. I've lost it. Yeah, 15. There's another engine burner. That is good, that's fine. There's more shields, not as good, that's fine. That shields, no, that's an old one. That must be old stuff. Right, I think we've got the best we can in here at the minute. So let's go into the bank, we'll put all the purples back across.
Okay, so we can sell sell that stuff. Yes, I know. I know it is some of the things that uh, that could be doing with uh, implemented and stuff. You can there's a lot of stuff that could be doing with being better, eh? Landing gear retracted. Let's move it away. Oh, right, okay. Now, if we go to hangar, maybe. It kind of makes sense having a terminal for dealing with your ships. Oh, no. yeah, it needs weapons as well. I, to be fair, I don't know if we've got the cash for that. Yeah, I've never actually tried getting it back on board the station without a ship being on the pad. Can it even be done? Oh, look, this has got a... <laughs> oh, my word, how janky is that? That's it. Oh dear. Right, okay. <laughs> oh, we can get back in. Right, let's uh, let's call one of the other ships. Uh, let's call... Can I call another ship until what? Until the big ship. Oh! Right, okay. So I wonder if we... No, because I think it'll replace that ship then. Now, there is like another hangar there. See, I was thinking, or I was kind of hoping even, that this ship would be big enough to hold the other command ship and all the rest of it, but I don't think that's going to be the case. Well, you can't even fly into that. There's no another terminal that I'm just not seeing. I don't think there is. It's your turn drained. Docking request granted. In order to use station services, please dock to the port reserved for you in the next minute. How do you dock this bugger? To just fly up to it and hope it docks. Yes. <laughs> right, okay, so. I've got a funny feeling when we try and do this, it's going to get rid of this ship.
Oh, hold on. Oh, now what's this? Deck one, deck two. Hey, right, hold on. Let's say uh, deck one. Oh, I wonder if this uh, deck one, deck two is for the mothership. Yes, aye, because it's got mothership there and then it's got this bit here. So you can do it from here. Oh no, I'll well, sell my stuff. I don't. We'll sell our junk. Maybe see if we can buy some weapons as well. Yeah, marketplace. In fact, what I'm going to do... Let's take all this stuff. Yeah, we've got there in the end. Let's just sell all. Right, so this ship can have the same idea. It can have the boosters and stuff, so let's just grab them. Might as well. Oh, we do a damage booster as opposed to the pods? Now I'll do the pods. Ah, uh, tier one. Okay. Well, let's we compare at least. Uh, ah, right, I thought you were on about. Uh, Aye, aye, you're on about the... Oh! That, all right, okay. Now I look back at Graham's bonbons, eh... Uh, thing where that makes sense. Now that we found it. <laughs> he should have said you do it through that. <laughs> I thought he was on about something different. Anywho. Right, so let's see, so that's what... So that's marginally bad as well. So there's nothing there. Out of curiosity, will it let me do anything on the big ship here? Need to do it through station services, right? That's fine. That's fine. What? Someone called the gaming tech? Oh my word. <laughs> yeah, that would have been the uh, the Hoochamai flip ship, wouldn't it? That, guy, <laughs> that guy's an amateur. <laughs> yeah, well, back then, yes. <laughs> 
but <laughs> I don't know. Right, okay, so we've got no decent weapons here. Let's put uh, these things into the edge of my flip. my ships. Yes, definitely. Always learning. It's funny because you know, it was about a year ago that I started doing YouTube videos and stuff like that and it was this game that built most of the channel. Can the majority of my, my subs and all the rest of it came from this game, uh, which is pretty crazy. And here we are a year, a year later back at it, uh, playing some of the content and stuff. Just to see what's all changed and improved, or not changed, and landing yeah, Imagine trying to fly this from this panel here. Holy crap! Look how much uh, shields we've got. Shields and armor, two hundred thirty-four thousand. I bet they go down quick. Wow. That is crazy. It's funny because uh, this is a funny thing. Because it's been that long ago since I've played it, you can have actually watched some of my old videos to work out what the hell to do. <laughs> I know what I was talking about. <laughs> Oh my word. And the teacher becomes a student. <laughs> well, that's the thing. Yeah. Yeah, will it fit through a Stargate? Because what we need to do... We've got to fly it. Well, that's it, yeah. Exactly, yeah. It, it fits through. Wow. Spoiler, Steve. <laughs> uh, not got any pews on it yet. Not yet, Shadow. Just got to duck along. Yeah, we've not uh, got any pew sticks for it. We're actually heading to that system where... Uh, where we've seen the blue pew sticks. Oh yeah, it needs... Oh yeah, yeah, it needs a way. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster in the It's gonna fit. Have I set the route? I did set the route. Do 
jump to next week. Please approach to the jump. Why didn't start. it do that through the control H? It, yeah, uh, yes. Now it's all to do with upgrading the the fleet, uh, Steve. Um, so, let, oh no, actually, we might be able to now uh, because obviously we can only have two, uh, four medium ships, two large, and one extra large. So, if we go into this one here, if we go to upgrade ship. And, oh no, they're only a fighter. Oh, hold on. Let's uh, go back, go back. Ah, right, let's go back here. Yeah. Yeah, so... That's the biggest ship that we're in, the uh, Shadow. The one that we're in, that's the biggest one that's available at the moment. Uh, right, so we can upgrade them. Cause we oh no, we have to be level forty. So we have to be level forty and able to get into the mothership for them. Oh, and oh, no, all right, no, no, I yeah, that's something different. I've not seen the trade ships yet, TQ. I've not seen them. Uh, these these ones here are for the the fleet shadow. So the extra large, that's yeah, that's aye, that's for these. We need to get in order to upgrade to that next ship. Um, we need them at level forty. So we can't upgrade them until level forty. Uh, so let's see. Yeah, so we've got one drone nest uh, ship, we've got one dreadnought, and then, yeah, obviously we've got capital ship or mother ship, but we can only have one. So, if anything, I think we'd be going for the capital ship, maybe. I don't know what would be best, actually. Uh, out of them, because we can only have one, which is a bit daft. You'd think you'd be able to have two. You could have one of each. But I suppose that'd be a bit overkill. Yeah, yeah, to be fair, yeah, it is, isn't bad. To be fair, I know it is a bit much to be fair, it is a bit much, but then I suppose there'll be some people out there that have got that no problem. Oh, somehow I think we've messed that up. Uh, I think for likes of the fleet stuff and everything shadowing, I think uh, X4 is still better for that. Because this, you can only use your fleets in combat in this game. Okay, what I mean, if you're overtaking a system or whatever. Whereas in, like, say, X4, you can go about with a fleet all you want. You reached the waypoint of your route. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. <laughs> Exit oh yeah, definitely. The yeah. System has been obtained. Yeah. The next waypoint is being passed. N three, two, one. You reach the waypoint of your route. Please wait for your ship yeah. to be scanned. Yeah. Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N three, two, one. Amarines, uh, pretty good for fleets as well, is it? Let us, I'm hoping we should be able to dock there because at the end of the day I was able to buy the ship there so we should be able to dock here 
If not, we'll hop into one of the other ships. I wonder how you access your other ships, actually. I've not seen how we access them. Oh, wow. It's a bit of a barge to turn. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thrust command. Alright, ah, okay. There, are. yeah. Yeah, yeah, it could be how it works, shadowing, yeah. So any station with a large uh, pad, eh? Oh, it's even highlighting it, to be fair. And I presume all I need to do is just... Yep, nudge it in like that. Yeah, we'll have to we'll have to try that because I've no idea how to get in them. Oh, hold on. Eh. Okay. Where is where's the dock? Where's the station? Oh, look at the textures are terrible. Wait. Why is the station away over there? It's 9,000 kilometers away. How did that happen? To. You should be able to just land on it like we had done. Might have to, which is stupid. I'll give it the benefit of the doubt. How fast is this bad boy? Oh, right, okay. We'll give that a bash, see what happens. So, dock, and then save, maybe.
paint. Open it, stole. Oh dear. Oh yeah, okay. Okay. All right, this time. Can they've got the they've got this ramp, which is a bit silly, but okay, that's how it is. Why not have it so you can run straight at it rather than have to come at silly angles? Because <laughs> yeah. it's designed by Kamei. <laughs> hey, right, so what we do? One five two, one two nine. Hey, Cloud, how you doing? You just spat your beer out your nose, how? <laughs> how have you managed that, eh, Steve? Eh, hey, let's see. Hey, ba -ba 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 -bum. What's on the agenda for today? Eh, hey, right, so what we've been doing, eh, uh, Klaus, is we've been doing, eh, uh, the mothership. Uh, well, exactly, yeah, exactly, TQ. Better drink it, no snort it. Right, let's hide all and let's do what turret filter like that. <laughs> hey, well, yes, I yeah, we're gonna be doing lasers, but I think um, I think we should really have a big cannon as well so we can actually because I'm pretty sure the lasers will fire themselves I think um, but then we've got the cannons which we can fire so we'll maybe have a look see what cannon we can fire two big cannons in static you think right well there's uh there's a 152 cannon. There's a 140. There's a 148. 140. Got a 129. 130. Right, so go for the. 148 as well. Yes, yeah, I remember that from the other ships who are pretty god awful. Uh, which I think, I can't even mind what I've done with the other ship. It was only one cannon and the rest the uh, lasers or something. So, what's the difference between. Obviously, we've got the lasers and we've got the static turrets. Now, I think we've only got, what, five, so we'll do the two lasers. And we'll maybe go for one of the static turrets, so 
Right, okay, go with that. Let's go chuck these in. Oh no, six maybe. I'm. Oh, excuse me, I'm presuming so. Shall be able to have another uh, static. So we'll go lasers. Right, could get another one. I think we had uh, another static or something, did we not? Didn't we? No. I don't think we did. We've only got big cannons there. Right, we'll have to find another one somewhere. Let's see if have they oh they've got another Mother Earth. Wait, what, 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 what? Did you select the weapon, a static tab in the weapon management? What do you mean by weapon management? Static turret. <coughs> There's one there. So there's, there's, see, I think the cannons uh, fire independent. Yes, yep. So there's cannons. Yep. Yep, so there's the cannons, so there's the shield damage and armor damage, and then there's static there. Yeah. Yeah, I was wondering what you're on about for a minute. Yeah, only shows the types, yeah. So I'm pretty sure, we'll find out, we'll find out, because I'm fairly sure... Uh, when you fire, uh, you obviously got control of the cannons, and I'm pretty sure the statics will fire on their own. As far as I remember, it might have changed since then, so I've no idea. We'll have to try it. Well, we'll maybe do something silly. In fact, we've got to try something that TQ was asking first. We'll fly to Asteroid Field and see if we can hop into the mining ship because we've got that on board. <sighs> yeah. I, I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure, uh, TQ. We'll have to check that out. We'll maybe get ourselves into a combat situation and try it. Yeah, let's see. Oh, 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 oh. oh Christ, just we've done the wrong thing. Landing gear retracted. Uh, 
Uh, no, we we bought the the mothership for what was it about sixty one million credits, uh, and some of the the cannons and stuff were about seven million. Yeah. Oh, in fact, yes. Yeah, because we had what a hundred and did we what have a hundred and twenty three mil or something? So let's have a look. Uh, yes, yeah, yeah. So we're not far off a hundred million credits so far, give or take. Yeah, TQ is probably about right there. Yeah, so we've probably spent about that. Now, obviously, I have made my money. Uh, during Monday and Tuesday night after work uh, doing AFK mining uh, for Ass Attack uh, and we made what 155.8 million doing that roughly 12 hours exactly yeah 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 when I was doing the AFK mining I was watching Fallout Oh, there we go. There we go. Steve's putting a, a better uh, breakdown of the costings. Right, let's try this. It's a barge. Weapons online. I know, yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm surprised. Uh, you can't use the faction, especially for this ship here, because you need it for the mission. Okay, it's actually a, a a mission for that. So it's like, well, why why can't we? Oh, that's right. Yes, the drones as well. We put drones in this, didn't we? Yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, you should get some sort of <laughs> hand in the invoice and hope that the the HR person uh, or the accounting person gives you gives you some money back out the petty cash. <laughs> Waiting for the thruster input. Yeah, petty cash. That's right, yeah. Yeah, if it's blue, they can. If they're red, they can. Right, so TQ is asking if we could come to an asteroid field and get into our mining ship. So I've not tried getting into one of the other ships yet. Right, so here's a mining ship. Oh, so it automatically spits the ship out. So, yes. Yes, yes you can. But the flagship will disappear. So I'm presuming... There we go. To get back on board. Just fly into the hangar. Oh, the asteroid will disappear. Why does it do that? It keeps doing that. You come in the door and you've got to turn around. It's annoying. Right, so we've seen that. So that's that's uh, pretty straightforward. Right, let us uh, have a look mission wise. So let's let's go into contracts and we'll go Galaxy Web. 
Looking for pilot. Uh, destroy gang squad. Yep, that'll do it. Accept. <laughs> let's uh, let's jump in at it. Uh, set it there. One one three eight. So let's track Atlas. Oh, oh, shit, wrong button. Eh, I presume so, yes. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure, well, you certainly could with the other ships, so, yeah, Alpha certainly can with this. Because I think you'll need them for defense, if anything. Oh, mind you, we've got combat drones. Cluster barrage. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster input. Do the control H on this. Please approach oh, the no. Got to be closer. Uh, no, you, you can do it when you're closer. I wasn't doing it beforehand. Can normally when I jump in, I can do it straight away. So the good thing is, yeah, you can do it. You just got to be closer. Please proceed to the path reserved for you. Oh, crap. Exit from the Divine Path. The jump operation is terminating. Yeah, well that's it, yeah. Exit from the Divine Path. The jump operation is terminating. Oh my word. Exit from the Divine Path. The jump operation is terminating. All right, okay. You I'll take the it. Point of your route. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. <laughs> Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N3, 2, 1. Destination reached. Right, so it's a bit of a faff getting it through the the Stargate, that's for sure. Because I didn't duck <laughs> Yeah, although it did do it in reverse, which is a bit weird. So I'm sort of backing up. Calibration module activated. Jump, that's it. Calibration amazing. completed. Waiting for the thruster input. Oh, Jesus. Weapons online. Shield recharging. <laughs> the game just crashed. <laughs> Oh, the good thing is it really saved when we got into the system. Oh, my word. <laughs> Just as we're starting to open up. <laughs> I know. Yeah. The computer couldn't deal with the sheer firepower of the ship. 
Uh, I think so. I think so. To be fair, it's always done that, regardless of whether you've got cargo or not. Um, yeah, it's just a, a silly little function coming through the stations. I suppose it gives gives you something to look at while you're waiting on the game load in the next system. Right, so we entered the new system. Ah, oh, yes, yeah, so we're good there. Now it'll be interesting to see, obviously I've not done any of the like cargo stuff, you know, I've not done any cargo running or anything like that, so yeah, chances are there will be like contraband in certain systems, so I suppose it's possibly got a function. Right, let's try this. Well, that's it, yeah, I do remember that, especially when mining, if you're going between systems and you had cargo, you'd get that, but I've not seen it uh, this playthrough, but then I've not really gone through different systems with cargo. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster input. So, let's get the weapons out. Yeah, so everything's firing. Well, they are firing. Or is that there? Oh no, my guns are firing. Not that I know what the hell is going on. Let's get the combat drones out. That lets you see round about, I suppose. Are they actually doing anything? Ground systems. Well, I don't know. Target destroyed. All right. Okay. So combo. Yeah. So you can set the drones. Set the drones to attack. A bit rubbish. Okay, I've just sat here. Yeah, the, the shields are... Uh, certainly going down. I don't... How, how do you fire the big guns? It's about to take my shields out. Yeah, 
Yeah, but they're not firing. Again, I can press a button and nothing happens. So I don't know what this. I don't know what the sketch is for me. Yeah, but even when I do walk the target. Target destroyed. Oh, it's gone now. Hmm, I'm not convinced. Again, if we never had the drones, God knows if we'd have survived that. Now, does the repair drones... Yeah, but you're getting, like, no feedback that they're firing. And so you, you're pressing the button, but you don't know they're actually firing. There's no... There's no input. You can't, I mean, you know, you know, hearing a bang or anything like that, it just... It's a bit meh. Aye, yeah, so... They obviously weren't firing, for whatever reason. So I can't use pod catchers on this ship. Because when you press the right mouse button, that's when it goes into that mode. So we'll have to get rid of the pod catchers. They're no good. I suppose if you're that desperate, you could get out a uh, get out of this ship and get into your wee ship. Drum systems. Return to deck. So let's see, the repair drones, I think the repair drones maybe do shields as well. The shields seem to go up a lot quicker when they're out, so that's quite handy. Use a lot of power though. I don't think I'm going to need four uh, big guns. So I wonder where, I take it the, the big guns must be on the nose of the ship. I have to really make out what guns are what. They're obviously above. As soon as you go down to about here, then I get out of the out of tracking, so they're up this area is the best way for them. Yeah. Yeah, so they're almost pointless. Let's go do another one. In fact, let's go to a station first. Uh, let's see, have we got like a normal station? There's Bounty Hunter's Guild. Right, okay. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Let's go to Galaxy Web. Let's just pick another one. Uh, dest oh! Destroyed mothership skeleton needs to be cleared. I wonder what it means by that. It's not like money. Factory must be protected. Gang squad. Pythian floor. Let's have a look then. Obviously, I don't think we can do that here, can we? No, okay.
Now, if we go to Armory, I th or was it Storage or Armory? Armory, I think. If we come here. No, it wasn't here, was it? No. It wasn't here. Hey, we've got cockpit. Damn it. Yeah. Is it storage? Hangar. Select components, the left screen shows the location. Oh no, that's something different. Yeah, let's have a look. Yeah, I know what you mean, because, yeah, it used to, used to highlight. Yeah. Like, so the components, yeah, it shows it there, but the weapons doesn't show anything different for that, which is a bit of a pest. Oh, no, oh, no, hold on. Ah. Yeah, we'll need to go back to the services console. I need to find the services console. I think there's one on the hangar, isn't there? Hey, the other thing I've just noticed, or I've just noticed, is... It's not letting you pick uh, weapon groups. I thought it shown something. Yeah, yeah, I, that's what I'd noticed, but it's not, it's not got weapon groups. There's no weapon groups here. So let's take the big cannons out of there. Let's do two and three. Yeah. Not that, that's not what I want. Static laser nine three two nine four three. Yeah, that's right. They fire at the same time. So I don't know why it was showing that. It's a bit weird. Right, so we moved him. Bloody hell. Right, let's see. Yeah, obviously you can see the, the turrets on the left hand side there. Underneath me it shows the turrets. Shows their location, which is in the middle of the ship. Oh 
people in China in the middle. I don't know if that's going to make any difference to it or not. We'll see. Right, let's go that away. I tell you what, let's save. Oh, Stargate, Stargate. I need a coffee. Calibration module active. Well, shields are still. Calibration Whoa. completed. Waiting for the thruster input. Yeah, yeah, it's a bit me. That's uh, yeah. And it's not like you can pick and choose where the where they're mounted, eh? Only front, middle or rear sort of thing. You don't have a root system to jump. Please hey. select a system via Space Atlas. Not pick the contract. Where are we? That one. Okay, let's uh, set that. I've not set the mission has been active. Track. Please approach to the jump point to start jump process. Yeah, but the repair drones actually help the shields recharge, I noticed. I noticed when you got the repair drones out, you got a boost in your shields. We're now back up to full shields. But yeah, obviously it does use power. Please proceed through the gate in the path reserved for you. Hmm. Yeah, certainly that's what it looked like anyway. That's what it looked like. Exit from the Divine Path. The jump operation is terminating. Exit from the Divine Path. The jump operation is terminating. <laughs> oh, that's so junky. You reached the waypoint of your route. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. Getting our shit scanned. Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N3, 2, 1. Destination reached. Right. Let us uh, see where we're going. There's no station here. <coughs> I'll go get a coffee first. I think I'll get a coffee first. We'll get ourselves lined up. Oh, now I can uh, calibration module activated. Still change the zoom on this. Calibration so I can bring that further in. Waiting for the thruster input. That may help. Exactly. Exactly. We'll go grab the coffee because that is more important. And I'll be right back, guys. I'll not be too long.
Right, I'm back. What have I missed? Is nobody talking to you, Steve? Uh, oh, you're sick of seeing this Steve as well. Oh, God, I, I thought it's the only one. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Steve. You can you, you can ask ask questions, all the rest of it. That's what I'm here for. You get what I mean? So, uh, obviously, like, they'll be, they'll be hanging out in the background, um, working away, probably playing playing their own games and stuff as well, so yeah, don't worry about asking questions. Or if you're the only person chatting, okay, you don't need to worry. See, there's Shadow Wing. See, I'm rang. <laughs> only joking, Steve. only joking. Oh yeah, that that's right, yeah, you're not modded on on this channel, are you? I can certainly mod you, Shadow Wing. Hey well, let's get the drones out because I think that's what's gonna keep me alive. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll sort that out. Target destroyed. Now I'm hearing big booms this time. Target shield target down. Target destroyed. Target shields down. I'm wondering if. Uh, see, I'm not firing any of the big guns. And I'm not firing anything. I don't think we've got anything targeted. <laughs> well, we've done that contract. Oh! Right, okay! Right, so the guns aren't making any sound. If you see there, if I hold on, let me get rid of the, let me get rid of the, the uh, Drum drones. Return to deck. Right. So yes, they do fire. They're just making no sound. So it's a wee bit disconcerting. It's about weird that. But I think, ah oh yeah, there's, certainly up this direction and stuff, they seem to be a lot better. Down here, they're not as good. I think I'm going to have to move them. Hey, Bal, hey, it is, it is pretty buggy at times. It is pretty buggy, to be fair, but it's still certainly playable. There has been... There has been a lot of fixes and stuff since I last played the game. Yeah, well, I did hear the, the big bangs, but... You can target pods. How would you target pods? Because if I hit the right mouse button... To stabilize, I wonder if I can just fire the. Because I can't even do the right mouse button to do that. Unless. Unless. Can I do it from here? 
No. As soon as I hit the right mouse button, uh, the pods, it changes to that screen. So I can't, uh, I can't highlight, can't even target them like normal. Yep, middle mouse button. If I click on it, the middle mouse button. Nothing. Can okay, I don't get to tar Hold on, hold on. What about if I put my weapons away? Hold on. Weapons online. Weapons away. Let's try it now. Still can't target them. As soon as I hit the right mouse button, it uh, jumps off of that onto that other screen. Yeah, I've got uh, pod collectors. Uh, I do have pod collectors, but we can't stabilize the pod. Can't fire the pod catcher until you've stabilized it. Now, it's possible if there's one that's already stabilized, because sometimes it can be. In fact, I'll be better off in this view. Yeah, that one's stabilized. So I can do that one. That one's stabilized. I can do that one. That one's stabilized. Should be able to do that one. Yeah, so we can get pods from here, we just can't stabilize them. No, that's stabilized. I wonder if they've stabilized themselves, because they weren't stabilized before. Or one of them wasn't, anyway. Eh, I'm not too sure, let's have a look. Oh, you never saw pods from the flagship. Eh, uh, only four. Only four. Now, I don't know if... Is it a bit for... See, now that's got... Fire group one. Fire group there. Yeah, so we're in ship screen. Where do we get like the general sort of information about the ship? Oh Christ, it's down here. Jesus Christ. Uh, let's see, does it say anything about it? Cargo slots, cargo capacity. Now, I think talents, I think there's something to do with It's the there's something to do with being able to have extra pods or something. There's something about it. That slows time, that increases warp speed. To ship parts. Right. It's not in there. It's not going to be that. Dynamic shield, what's this? There's something that allows you to have... Warp 
with prisoners or something. I'm sure of it. Or was it pod catchers? Uh, that gives you extra slots in the gal uh, galaxy banks. That's a compressed thing. What's this? Adds one probe slot to all ships. Increases signal lifetime rate. Uh, what's this? Each time you deal damage. No, that's not it. That's next damage. Aye. Adds one dro adds drone slot to the carrier class ships. Adventure bottom left. Uh, you've got increased ship's warp speed. Drone spawns, level 1 or higher. Player's level, drone spawn. That's increasing. I'll tell you what, I want to increase that anyway. I'll do that one. Yeah, that, that's just on about drones. That's just on about drones. So maybe there isn't anything for... Oh, no, I wonder if it's maybe... Oh. Maybe something we can add to the ship. Kind of like a different module or something. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, it could be like a ship module. Hey, uh, right, you're on about. See if we can add. Yeah, we can't can't add these to anything there. And when we click on weapons, yeah, it's only showing. See, that's not right. Or or is that? We're done. Uh, we'll have a look in that in a minute, uh, TQ, yeah. I've, I'm not too clear. So you've got... It's weird there because, yeah, it's got static laser group one. Yeah, there's certainly something there because, yeah, it's only listing the cannons in group two fire. And it's got the two static lasers there, and there's no mention of the static turrets there. Unless this side's all bugged and you ignore that, I don't know. Doesn't make sense. So you can't do anything with this. You can't. Oh! Oh! That just opened up! What? Why is that just started working now? <laughs> ah, whoa, weapon class. Right, so I need to either have static or... Oh, class one, class one. Right, weapon class doesn't match. Right, so we either need... Aye. Okay, so we need you need lasers or static turrets. You can't have a mix. Right, okay, so that could explain why our firing is near the best. But that wasn't working before. I was clicking on that and nothing was happening and then all of a sudden it started to work. That is weird. Oh my word. See this game at times. Right, so we need to get rid of, uh, yeah. <laughs> now, funny you should say that. I'll probably be doing one uh, tomorrow at some point. <laughs> oh my word. Yeah, 
I know. I know. Yeah, certainly, certainly some things we can certainly put down into a video, that is for sure. That is for sure. Right, so let us go and see if we can find... Uh, let's see if we can go and find... Pijama flips. More uh, lasers. Need more lasers. Lasers. Oh really? I'm surprised. So I'm sure when I was doing videos in this, there was a few people doing videos. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster input. to the jump point to right, start. I tell you what, let's process. change view. Let's see if being inside the cockpit's a little bit easier for this. The external view is a bit bad. Please proceed through the gate in the path reserved for you. So cockpit view seems to be a lot easier you for flying into the route. station and starting to be scanned. Okay. Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N3, 2, 1. Destination reached. Eh, uh, well, it was, I found it was really awkward lining the ship up with the, basically the, the letterbox. Uh, it was really awkward lining the ship up with the letterbox in this view. It certainly was a lot easier doing it in the cockpit view for this ship. You can normally light your fighters in that, you can do it in the external view, no problem. So yeah, it's maybe a good idea for for that. Aperture, yeah, there's a good word. Right, so what were we looking for? We're looking for a station. So we are one in. There's a faction hangar. Oh no, I don't think we can dock at faction hangars. There's a station though. Let's go there. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thrust of the input. Doesn't look like we can dock here either by the looks of it. Docking request granted. In order to use station services, please dock to the port reserved for you it, in the next minute. It is, it's just at the other side.
That is true. That is true. Yeah, we could uh, use a smaller ship if we can. Uh, park, I suppose. Uh, right, let's see. Hangar. What? I'll tell you what this ship could do with. Oh, yeah. Sounds like a good idea. I'm not saved for a wee while. What would be handy is being able to actually go straight to the landing pad. Getting the steady humming to come out through here. It's a bit of a, a bit of a faff. But then, not really. <laughs> Just be picky. Now I was going to do something, wasn't I? Give me a second, let me just do something. Purely what it's down to. Oh no. Ah. Hold on. Maybe I can only do it in this menu. Shadowing modded. Should have done that earlier. But I didn't. Right. Eh, uh, right, let's see. Uh, let's see. Right, weapons, weapons, weapons. <laughs> well, yeah, why not? Yeah. Why not? Right, so do we go with... Now, obviously the lasers here aren't going to be up to scratch, so I'll just uh, I'll just grab a couple of... Do we have any... How many static lasers have we got? Let's see. Hide all. Flagship weapons. Uh, static laser. Static laser. What do you think would be better? Do you think it would be better with... Uh, you are blue. 740 on the static turret. 775 for the laser. 719. 692. 705, I tell you, right, I tell you what, let's go lasers. Lasers. Oh, let's have a look at ship components as well while we're here. Oh, now we need more. Could you have a flips? You prefer turret? <laughs> oh, that's a yeah. Oh no, there's aim and extension. Uh, that's two point three. Yep. So, do we have any other? Right. So let's pick that up. We'll get the hull. Well, that's it, yeah. I suppose that's the the good thing of being a, a small channel, I suppose. <laughs> Don't have to deal with as much crap. Uh, certainly noticed we YouTube, there is no uh, bots at all, is there? Not seen any bots on the uh, YouTube sides of it. Uh, 
Ding, da, 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 ding. Ne, wo, oh ne, wo ist das von? Ähm. I think we got a hole, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, that's it, yeah. Yeah, it's been pretty straightforward, to be fair. Oh, are you? Oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah, you were on about that. Uh, a couple of streams ago, yeah. Right, weapon management. So we'll take the statics out. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully that'll, that'll all come to an end pretty quick for you, Shadow. Let's put that in there and then want the Does it matter which lasers go first? Static turret, static turret. Okay, well, let's go to the bank. Uh, static turret, let's put that in the bank and that one. Seven oh five seven seven five nine four three nine four three nine three two seven seven five seven oh five right so that should be fine we just need to fix that out put the pod catchers in right so we've got aim let's take that out put that one in hull X Oh, I've got two hull X's. I've got one for 25. Hull X. 20, 25. 25. Aim, I think we have got the best one in. Yep, yeah, right. Can sell that stuff. Just double check, make sure we've got everything we can have. I think we have, to be fair. I think we're good. I think we are good. Right. Uh, let's see. What have they got ship wise here? They've got Mother Earth here. How much is that? 67 mil. Oh, look at that. It's got better shields and stuff. What's the name of this system? What's this system? To N2. Might come in handy. Right. Oh, we have people we can sell as well. So there's 331, 473, 473, 260. Nice. Right, so let's have a look. If we go back into the ship under weapons, yeah, so it's automatically put them in the two different uh, categories. Yeah, so we've got the cannons, put the cannons back at the front, and then it's all static lasers.
The command ship, yes. Now, what we've got in this ship, uh, uh, TQ, is we actually have uh, an option in here to do it. It was in the mechanics bit. So if we, oh god, pain. So let's see where, oh no, where was it? If we go to, is it armory maybe? Yeah, yeah, th there's a thing in here, uh, I'm pretty sure. There's a thing called mechanics. If we can find the bugger. Oh my word. Can it, why does it not have? Can it's got a thing for storage, it's got a thing for armory. Why not have a thing for mechanics? Oh, ah, here we are, mechanics. Tell you what, let's just save. So you've got this table here, which has got your ship upgrade console in it. So we're already the highest tier. Obviously, I've not bought any any modules, which I presume I could buy in modules at the faction hangar place and put them in here I presume we'll have to play about with that at some point uh, obviously you can add saying add tier but it's saying highest tier because it is a tier 4 so we can't do that so we can add levels oh max level so we can't do anything so what's the point in this? I suppose we can add things into the two, I presume. Just not got anything. Hmm. Ah, right, okay. Yeah, so, ah, yeah, because we are, what, pilot? Are we pilot, uh 25? I think we are, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Oh, so is that max level for, uh Well. We're about to pi uh, level up, maybe. Let's do another uh, web contract before we finish up for tonight. Uh, let's see, we want to just uh, do another gang squad or something like that. Let's just do that one. Oh, that's it, yeah. Yeah, but we are max level in relation to the ship. Because the ship was uh, required level for the ship was 25, and we are 25, so maybe that's why we can't. Because it's still showing a, a number for upgrading. So we'll have to uh, check that out. Oh yes, yeah, you could go to the faction hub to get that, but I'm not going to do that then now. I've not got enough time for that, I don't think. Got to try the the weapons out again. Landing gear retracted. So we're just going to do a quick mission. I 
I don't even know what you'd add to this. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster input. Shields are down. Why is my shields down? Torpedoes. Mm. Don't know if I'd want to do torpedoes. Never used torpedoes to be fair. Please approach to the jump point to start jump process. Please proceed through the gate in the path reserved for you. A shield boss? Oh, I'm not too sure. of your route. Please wait for your ship to be scanned. Exit permission from the system has been obtained. The next waypoint is being passed. N3, 2, 1. Destination reached. Right, okay. No oh god, that's my also here. Yeah. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster input. Oh, well, let's see what this does. Oh, I never saved. Oh, it saved as we came in. Should be fine. Let's balance that out. That'll well, put more power to the shields, I suppose. Okay, so what we've got, 23,000, eh, 236,000 Right, so I've not selected anything. And it seems to be firing on its own. without getting the drones out. Right, so selected a target. Did they actually f <laughs> Hey, 
Okay, so I can't fire the guns at that angle. Right, so they're rubbish in that mode. Right. Tell you what, let's get the drones out. Certainly, uh, Shields again. Target destroyed. Let's turn them off. Could do a cluster barrage. Yeah, no, I was just sort of sitting, wasn't I? I was just wanting to see what they, they would all do. Definitely managed to get everything we wanted done. See, it's still... Where did you get them to stabilise? Right, so let's see if to... Yeah. Let's get them back. Hey, let's see. We've got, we've got the same situation with the pods. It's like, oh, they're spinning. And we can't do anything because it all. If I just hold the middle mouse button then. Space bar? No. It's annoying that. Yeah, yeah, and that's probably how they did stabilize for us the last time. So they've done it over time. I think it was just pure fluke that they'd done it, I think. Let's move. Ken one, oh, Ken one, I forgot to do the last time. All the other times, never combined the crates. What dafty. I've got to sit here all night waiting for them to stabilise. So it's kind of pointless unless you're in this system long enough to uh, wait for the pods to stabilise. It's a bit rubbish. I wonder. Uh, let's see, inputs. Is it a bit for like stabilizing pod? Does it have its own little command? I 
guys don't loot play cap. That's a bit of a pest. That's a shame. Well, that one's stabilized. That ain't a view we'll get. <laughs> we'll get these pods after all. <laughs> oh my word. Right, okay. Right, let's finish up. Uh, let's let's see if I tell you what I'll wait until they've come into cargo. Yeah, we've we'll got them both there. Right, so four hundred thousand, so that's not too bad. There's a better aim extension thing as well for us. So we've got a slightly better module for the ship as well, which is quite good. Right, okay, let's save. Right, let's get that screen up. Right, okay guys and girls, obviously, thank you very much for watching. It's been an absolute pleasure. Not been... Uh, not done as much as I thought we'd do, but we have done a lot at the same point, a lot of testing and stuff like that for for the, the ship. So hopefully that's answered a, a few questions. Um so hopefully that's that's helped a little bit. Yeah, no problem guys. It's always a pleasure to be fair. You know me, I do enjoy the game. So Tomorrow, I'm not too sure what my plans are tomorrow, so obviously I'm working in the morning and I might be going over to my friend's house tomorrow night, so there's a possibility I'll not be streaming tomorrow. Uh, just depends if plans change or whatever. Because uh, I want to try and... I need to make at least one video, possibly two. Uh, so I want to try and do that tomorrow. Well, maybe getting Manor Lords on the first. Oh, awesome, Shadowing. Awesome. Uh, obviously, uh, I shall catch you tomorrow. I was going to say catch you tomorrow. Hopefully, I'll catch you tomorrow. If not, I'll definitely be on Sunday. Uh, obviously, if you're watching on YouTube, please do like the video. It'll help it go out to other people and all that rubbish with algorithm stuff. If you're on Twitch, we'll have a look and see if we can raid someone. Uh, and we'll go and see what they're up to. Uh, but yeah, other than that, thank you very much for watching. It's always a pleasure, guys. Oh, we'll go see Spoonfed. He's playing No Rest for the Wicked. I would see that. Uh, and yeah, we'll be on Sunday. Definitely Sunday. Uh, if I'm not on tomorrow, because like I say, I think I might be busy tomorrow night. But yeah, thank you very much as always, guys, and I shall see you soon. Till then, take care, stay safe and all that good stuff. Bye for now.